Yeah. Hey there, and welcome to the sixth episode in the second season of the Hue video series. Today we'll be talking about accessing HBase through Hive and Pig. We'll also be exploring that data using the HBase app. Here we are at the HBase browser. As you can see, there are no tables. We go to the Hadoop Tutorials GitHub to get the Hive script for creating an HBase table. Now, in Beeswax, we enter our script. Notice we move the Zookeeper address to the settings on the left-hand side. This script will create a Hive table called TopCoolHBase. It'll be persisted in an HBase table called TopCool. Now, using the Metastore browser and HBase browser, we can see our new tables. Notice the HBase table is completely empty. Let's populate it. We go back to the Hadoop Tutorials GitHub and grab the insert statements. Then, we paste it into the query editor. The four jars specified in the query can be placed under file resources. They need to be uploaded into HDFS. The script finished, now we can look at our data in the HBase browser. The HBase browser comes with a smart search with autocomplete. Let's find a Thai restaurant. Going back to the Metastore browser, we can see the data as well. This means it's queryable in Hive. Let's do some computation on our HBase table using pig. Let's grab a simple pig script from the Hadoop Tutorials GitHub. This script dumps counts for a particular day. As usual, the jars in the script need to be put into HDFS and referenced in the resources of the pig script. In one click, we submit our pig script. Notice the life progress and the logs. Say fini, we have all our data. Well, that's it. We hope the new HBase browser makes exploring your data really easy. Thank you for watching, and see you at the next episode.